Hey, thanks for joining me for a couple of minutes today. We've talked a little about this whole concept of life winding upwards for the wise. And it's absolutely my conviction that people's lives should increase in their value, in their beauty, in their influence for good, and that they should, in other words, wind upwards. One of the things that I've found that in my generation and actually in generations before and after mine is still a really big thing for people is that they don't, they've never been allowed or permitted to fail. And they've grown up with a mentality like failure is, is, is final, is devastating. And that kind of thinking leads to common problems, common responses. So when you meet someone who is, for instance, um, very defensive uh, of their position, I did this because, or I did that because, um, oftentimes they're trying to strengthen a position that they feel inside themselves because they are afraid to fail. Often when people suffer from what we would call a victim mentality, in other words, it was it was you that did that. It was it was you that did that. It was it's somehow not my fault. And the root behind so many of these things is simply that we've never been encouraged or helped to know how to fail. I feel like putting a sign up over my life or over my house or over the church or whatever that says. You can fail here because when you allow yourself to fail and you realize actually you're still of great value, the fact that you fail doesn't change that at all. Once you start to embrace that idea, you're on the road to a rising life, an increasing life. Thanks for sharing this time with me.